So yeah, no, I mean, it was it was surprisingly easy with, when you have a guy like Mark and a director of photography like Mark Dahlgren, you know, and uh, and there's no bad angle to shoot Jamie from. So you can find you can find creative places to cover things that you can't necessarily show on network. Uh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. You know what? I wish I said it was hard. I mean, this has literally been a charmed casting process. We, had, we got our first choice for every single character. From number one to number seven on the call sheet, all of the leads are our first choice. That never happens. For a lot of reasons. One, you know, to get both the network, the studio, and you to agree on people is sometimes really difficult. And then two, it's hard to get great people, let alone a bunch of great people. So Jamie was first, you know, um, uh, she just really responded to the character. You guys are going to talk to her. I'll let Jamie tell you why she's doing it. And then, you know, for, for Sullivan, you know, we were both of them do something that's kind of unique, and it's what makes stars, which is like they are both incredibly tough, but they have a they have a vulnerability underneath that is like very accessible. Like there's a there's a hurt to Sullivan's performance that I think is like really beautiful. It gives him a dimension as, as opposed to just being like I'm the tough guy. You know, like I punch people. I'm, like, I'm an FBI. Like the, where we're going with his character and why those two are so intertwined is like it's a very emotional story. And so we needed two people that could could handle that. And then to have you know Marianne John Baptiste, like Academy Award nominee Marianne John Baptiste, in our stable to be able to go to her. Like I here, here's when you you know when you're cutting shows. I, this is the first show I've ever been on where you don't have to protect anybody in the editing room. You know what I mean? Where you're not, every show I've worked on, there's been at least one person where you're like, they need a lot of help, they need a lot of work, you gotta run, run takes backwards, you gotta use dialogue from one take and put it in their mouth for another, and you don't have to do any of that with them. This is, so as a storyteller, that's like an amazing gift to have your seven lead characters all be able to carry scenes. Not, alone, not to mention just be alive when there's seven of them in there, you know? Most people, it's like someone else is talking, sometimes their faces just go neutral, like everyone is so in Involved and they're trying to ground it. It's, it's very exciting. So, um, I'm going to learn that the fans are kind of comparing her to a female Jason Bourne. Do you yeah. think that, is that fair? I think it's a fair comparison. I mean, you know, she definitely has got some memory problems. And, uh, and she's a crazy badass. Like, she's clearly had some sort of... Say military training, but she's had some sort of you know <laughs> combat training. Um, so yeah, no, I think it's a fair comparison. So can you talk a little bit about the importance now of social media sure. initiatives with everything? 